Oh, we'll walk around the combo once again. Oh, once again. Yes, we'll walk around the combo once again. Oh, once again. Yes, it's time to see some cats. Grab a blanket and some snacks. Oh, we'll walk around the combo once again. Gibson. Gibson, do you see what's... Do you see what's happening? <laughs> don't... Don't... Come over here and bury your head in shame. Go and do something about it. Besides, you have a lot of, a lot of seeds. These trees during this time of year, they have uh, these little seedlings. Let's see if you can get a good look at those things. Those little devils. And then they, they get on the ground. And then they get on Gibson. Devils, you're just letting, you're just letting this happen right now. Quite frankly, it's it's affecting my opinion of you and your guardianship. Unless, of course, you have a some form of arrangement with the gals. Oh, where? <laughs> what? What's that all about? Okay. All right, let's go see some cats. Do the thing. I know he. I know he. It rained a lot. It rained a lot like yesterday afternoon, and then it rained a lot. Uh, this well, last night overnight it rained a lot overnight, and then it rained most of the day today. So I get it. I get your current predisposition towards box box and hay I get it I get it do 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 oh my leak pretty girl how are you how are you? How are you, Petey girl? How are you, Petey girl? My Petey, my Petey little lady. My Petey little lady. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa there. Whoa there. Whoa there. Excitement. Gate, 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 gate. <laughs> hey. What are you doing? You're being crazy. You're being handsy. You're being really peatsy. Hey. <laughs> it's a little nibble. And there you go, a little spritz. <laughs> Would you like a spritz? It's like a weird waiter at a fancy restaurant. Would you like a spritz of lynx pea on your salad? Oh, yes. Hey, Rosh. Looking good. Yeah, looking good. Old gal, looking good. You're keeping it together. I'm proud. Proud of you. Thumbs up. It's been kind of a odd time. We haven't really been getting much in the way of uh, cow and horse calls. Been uh, it's been really dry in that respect. What in the literal? aspect but uh, dry in the figurative it's raining cows and horses aspect we've been having to dip more into the savings account so to speak aka the big walk-in deep freeze and don't get me wrong i mean we have pallets and pallets of chicken and miscellaneous meat stuffs thank goodness but it's been a few weeks it's been a few weeks. 
which which it does happen. I don't want to be alarmist. I don't want to be like this has never happened. No, it just sometimes yeah, like you're you're bound to have like a couple of kind of dry spells. Uh, it's funny I say that like as I'm like squashing squashing through a puddle. <laughs> hey, Brandy, <I'm> you. <laughs> But you are, you're bound to have a couple of dry spells for cows and horses uh, throughout the year. It just happens. That's why we got the savings account. AKA the deep freeze. And this chin. Okay, let's go and see. <gasps> There's a Mr. Luca. There's Mr. Luca. Ooh. How you doing? Ooh. You got the, uh, I just woke up and I'm kind of trying to figure out my bearings. <laughs> Who, wait a minute, why do I have all these stripes? What's going on? Oh, that's right, I'm a tiger. I'm going back to bed. <laughs> Good boy. Yeah, you don't have to come over. Yeah, there's a good boy. Look at that. He really did. He kind of considered. And then he was just like, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, that's... You've earned it, bud. You've earned it. Oh, hi. Hello. <laughs> she come back in here to pee some more <laughs> yeah <laughs> she's like yep how'd you know so like, you could go outside you could pee. you could pee outside in fact i would prefer you did that it's like that's dumb that's dumb why would i do that when i have indoor peeability I know. The comforts of modern living. Yep. Filling it back up. For another round. And we go the distance. Just like Rocky. No one's ever gone the whole distance. No one's ever peed a full 15 rounds. <laughs> you don't have to try to break that record. Oh, he emerges. Now, Luke is a good boy. Whenever we clean his hay, I mean, don't get me wrong, there's pee, but I mean, it's, it's a little bit more of a reasonable amount, a respectable amount of pee, a gentleman's amount of pee. <laughs> What a good boy you are. What a good boy you are. Yeah, what a good boy he is. This the sweetest of babes. Look at him, what a good boy. <laughs> what a good boy, see? Respectable, gentlemanly. Yeah, good stuff, bud, good stuff. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Have a sweet guest here who uh, is familiar with this stuff here this uh this camera stuff is one of uh is one of is one of you types of folks you webcast watchers yeah she's very nice but it kind of threw me it not not like you know like completely like whoa <laughs> but she's like yeah you know the thumbnail on this one i'm just like uh, uh. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, 
He's like, yeah, the thumbnail guys had the what, overly attached girlfriend. And then I'm like, I don't even know if Melissa chooses those. And she's like, well, you kind of told her to. And I'm like, yeah, I suppose you. <laughs> so, yeah. Hello. You, you, like, I spent so much time in here, like this, this area. But now, uh, you're here. That's cool. Nido Bandito. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hello you big cat lovers out there, it's me Derek again. Welcome to another super duper fantastic episode of the Walk Around the Compound webcast. Hi, hello. Oh, speaking of uh, speaking of thumbnails, let's get a let's get a good one for Melissa. So you gotta you gotta be like 17 things that you know like about tigers that are gonna blow your mind and then like the person <laughs> Yeah, that, that, I think one of those will work. Munch, hi. <laughs> he is a good boy. He's a good boy. Who enjoys the company of friends. Where everybody knows your name And we're always glad you came Yep. <laughs> Old Munchie Dahmer over here. Relax, I just want to take some snuffles. I think that that's a turd that got mushed into the grass. I think that's <laughs> I think that's a grass mushed turd. Smash turder. <laughs> You're very snuffly today. Very very snuffly. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hold on. Oh, he's peeing. Wow, a gentleman's, a more gentleman tigers. A gentle sir. Fedorable. Hey. Hi, big guy. I go over here, okay? Hi, mister. Hi. Yeah. You're a good boy. You're yeah, a good boy. I thought that we were able to kind of soften some of our relations. That doesn't seem, it doesn't seem like the softest of language. Doesn't seem like the softest of rhetoric. Seems actually like some, it's somewhat hostile. I don't. I'm not like 100% fluent in Bobcatese. But it doesn't seem like uh, trade negotiations are flourishing. Did you know? And then. There's little Mia. She's been eating real good, taking her medicine, and I think, I think she's only got. Ooh. I believe it's like less than a week. Less than a week's worth of uh, medicine that she's got to take. She's been doing really good. She's probably wondering why I'm not carrying a food bowl right now. Believe it or not, I do believe that. Now she's still a little, you know, mistrusting. And will uh, meet with uh, general feelings of aggression towards myself and also Heidi. But, 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 slightly softened. 
softened slightly, which is a thing that happens with sick animals. Heidi has seen that phenomenon play out many, many times, where it's like you get an animal that's uh, kind of ornery, bit of a jerk, and then they get sick, so then you have to take care of them. And just the, the volume of exposure to the person or people that they dislike kind of kind of not like completely snaps sometimes like snaps them out of it but really or it, at least just kind of be like all right maybe i was getting a little bit too overzealous with my opinions in the past i can kind of smooth it out a little bit because they are feeding me and taking care of me i'm feeling a little bit better when i'm in their presence i don't know how to explain it i'm a cat i don't understand uh, the wonders of modern medicine. All I know is that I'm starting to kind of climb out of this weird thing that I was feeling before. Uh, so this person may or may not be magic. Not sure. Not sure. I'm not going to hate him as much as I used to. There's Mr. Munchman. Wait, Munch... Sorry. Oh my gosh. Wow. Why did I say that? <laughs> no. That's Shanti. Oh boy. We might be seeing a moment. There's a tie there's a tail that's because because sibling is over there distracted. Now she's joined in. Now she's joined in. It was before it was going to be like, I'm going to pounce on my sister. And then now it's like, you know what? I'm going to join. I'm going to join in your, your struggle and in your protest against that stupid Leon, that stupid Leon Bandito and his dumb, cute face. Oh, he's so handsome. I hate it. Hate him. What is that? What is so basic? What are, what are you guys doing? Taking shifts? What is that? You just clock out? Oh no, you're Shanti. I mean, I mean, Mama Shanti. And then that's Mama Derek Naya. Okay, let's not pee. No, thank you. No, thank you. Wow. They really did. They really did. They just they tagged out. Okay, I've been telling the cute guy next door that his face is stupid and uh, and that his his lips are offensively soft and they look offensively soft and smoochable. <laughs> so can you take over cuz I'm my legs are getting a little tired. I need to go I need to go <laughs> get a drink. I know when you really think about it, you kind of like have, there's like an eclipse like every day, you know, cause like basically like the earth, and it, it like turns and then all of a sudden it's like, it's between you and the sun and then, you know, it's like dark and you can't see the sun and it's like, whoa, you know, like, you know, and that's like basically like an eclipse too, you know? <laughs> Hi, bud. What is it with it in the peeing? Fred. I mean, Fred. Mm, man. Hello. Is that, that's... Alien? Is that alien? I don't know. Might be con. Yeah, that's Bandito. That's Bandito.
I heard hissing. I heard elevated hisses. Well, actually, I mean, really, they're like more like kind of closer to the ground hisses. You know what I'm talking about. Hi. <laughs> Ooh, your pupils are getting all big. It's time, you know, there's golden hour, and then golden hour is always followed shortly thereafter by sharky hour. <laughs> it's like right after golden hour ends. That's when sharky hour begins. <laughs> That's when the pupils get big. Yeah. Good girl. Ah. Focus. 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 There we go. Everyone needs a hobby. Okay. It's like when, uh, it's like when you have a, you know, kid that basically says like I have dreams of becoming the world's greatest mouth harpist. That's like the that old timey You can look up videos of like mouth harps. If you hear them, if you don't know what they are but you like you just listen to a video of like what it sounds like, you'll be like, "Oh, that thing." Kind of associated with like hillbillinisms. Hillbillinism. I'm, I'm sorry, you've been, uh... Doctor, what's going on? He's like, you've been, uh... You have stage four hillbillinism. Oh, no! See, that's... You do that. It's one of the reasons why you do that now. No, but, uh... The, uh, you have a kid that like says like, I want to be like the world's greatest mouth harpist. Oh, look at that. That's a nice silhouette. And then you're like, I guess. All right. You go to like a recital and it's, you know, like you don't get the, you don't get the passion of it. You don't like, like, I don't quite get it, but I mean, I'm happy that you're happy and you're doing a thing that's cool and productive so okay that's how I felt about Naya over there why are you limping probably was just laying on his arm that happens sometimes her arm just kind of goes to sleep they hit their funny bone Yeah, stretch, dude, stretch. <laughs> Don't, if you get up too fast after you've been sitting down for a while, you know, you get a head rush or something like that. Maybe it's one of those types of things. Hmm, what's going on with you? Hopefully it's not anything too serious. We'll keep an eye on it. Hey, hey, come here, come here, come here, come here. Ah, a gentlemanly pee. And that would, that is actually Leon. Okay, so the one that was pacing back and forth inside the lockdown was Khan. Yeah, it all makes sense now. Hmm. Got something going on with this Pete. Oh, all right, all right, well. What are you doing? Yep, he's got something going on. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I mean, there's that. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's what that's what comes. Yeah, I know, Fred. Right? You wish you kind of didn't investigate so much now. All right. All right. Thanks for watching this episode of the Walk Around the Compound webcast. Hashtag Dorbus Ward in the comment section below. Like and subscribe for all of your big cat goodness. And if you want to learn more about the facility around me, you can always visit the website carerescuetexas.com for more information. You keep those tigers fed. Big shout out to the extra fancy patrons. I see you. You are so fancy. And thank you so much for your continued support. And we'll see you next time. We'll, uh, we'll keep an eye on Leon and we'll keep you posted if anything, if anything changes. I'm sure it's just a something akin to like tiger sports injuries something oh i smacked my brother in the head too hard you know something like that i wouldn't be surprised if he's up and running around by morning so like i said we'll keep you posted all right bye bye <laughs>